The Guardian has published a new report in which it criticized the Indian PM's statement that his country is the mother of democracy in the world when Muslims are being killed and harassed by the police and Muslim students are victims to maltreatment in schools. The Indian journalist Rana Ayub, who wrote the article, said that Muslims in India are not just humiliated on the streets, they are being demolished and vilified on the big screen. Modi has praised and defended two films that have been criticized as deeply Islamophobic, The Kashmir Files and The Kerala Story. In his election rallies, Ayub also added that over the past year, through his much publicized state visit to the United States and through his much talked about trips, including the G7 meetings, Modi has extolled the virtues of democracy of a secular and inclusive nation paying obscenes to Mahatma Gandhi at every available opportunity. She stressed that but this grandstanding is in fact a dialectical facade. The ugly reality of present day India is that minorities are under relentless attack. The India journalist cited an example of anti-Muslim hatred, saying that on 31st of July, a railway police constable, Chetan Kumar Singh, opened fire on board a long distance train, first killing his senior officer and proceeding to kill three Muslim passengers. She continued that after shooting them, he stood by a profoundly bleeding corpse and invoked Modi and his Hindu nationalist ally, Yogi Adinath, and a rant during which he said, if you want to live and vote in Hindustan, I am telling you it is only Modi and Yogi, these two people.